This ought to work. Well, so why are we here exactly? Heard Carrie got himself a buck of mansion here. Done well. Where'd you hear anything about Carrie? In and about town. Scream sheets are full of shit about him. Oh, right. You weren't around. Mm-hmm. Your big night out. So what? Wanna pay him a visit? Yep. Seems as good a time as any. You always did have some beef with him, didn't you? Me? Nah. He's the one who couldn't decide whether to fuck me or boot me out of the band. Which were you hoping for? Problem with Care was he had a dick. Meaning I wasn't interested. But he was missing the balls. Only posed as a rebel to fit in. Actually desperate not to step on any toes. Arasakas especially. So I gotta hit Carrie's digs, look around, critique the drapes. Know what they're writing about him? He's depressed, attempted suicide. What, really worried he wants to hurt himself? Who knows? Either way, could give him some pointers. Meaning you want to go in person. Gotta hand you the reins again. Yes. Behaved myself last time, didn't I? I think I warrant another furlough for good behavior. What was that about attempted suicide? Amateur hour. Didn't even cobble together the right audience. Tried to put a bullet through his skull in his room. Bodyguard took his gun like candy from a baby. Could just be the rumor mill. Sure, could. But I want to know. Okay, but I want to know what you plan to do. Nothing stupid, I promise. Just want to see how he's doing. How you plan to tell him it's you? Could be dealing with some real personal shit right now. Might not be the best time to mess with his head. V Care was always dealing with personal shit. That's why, in spite of everything else, we got along. Don't worry. I'll play it by ear, sensitively. First things first. We gotta get into that house. Okay. Just let me know when you want to take the wheel. The hell's this freak tech? Fugly as seafood barf. Hope it was expensive, at least. Something's gotta justify this level of tacky.
<laughs> Fuck. Cookie cutter crap straight from a catalog. Doubt Carrie picked this. Always ate out. Always. What's old single we put out? No idea why Carrie hoards shit like that. What's second conflict? Carrie'd always go straight for kitsch with titles. Guess nothing's changed. Never fade away. Guess if I had a fave, it'd be that one. Okay, <laughs> even I know that one. An oldie but a goodie. Ah, oh, beautiful butterfly Carrie emerging from his silky samurai chrysalis. I'll give him that one. Wicked bad collection. Well, now I am impressed. Played a few of these myself back in our samurai days. Looks like that run as many eddies. Forget it. We couldn't afford it. That's Carrie's fave. Looks like he's showering. Alone, too. Good thing, believe me. Okay, leave the rest to me. I'll get him out of there. Drop one of Misty's special pills. Let's go. Okay. so much better now let's see which you're up for show and which you're actually strummable we lost everything No. That is some fucking joke. Hang on. What did Silverhand tell me before he died? Told you to leave Samurai. Go your own way. Clearly I was right, as I often am. Johnny fucking Silverhand.
I mean, how? Surprise. Motherfucker! Okay, weren't expecting me. I get it. Oh, fucking contraire. Been waiting 50 years to do that. She had changed a bit. Sporting a new style, trying to stay hip. Yeah, kinda. What about you? Shit. Johnny. Oh, man. I need a drink. All right. Come on. Tell me. Why do you look like a small-time kleptopunk from the afterlife? Long as you tell me what you got in your throat. Always did complain I couldn't carry a tune. Nice place. Ain't seen much of it yet. Moved in after the fourth album came out. All sold well, apparently. Fuck you, Johnny. Don't even start. Who'd you sign with? Shit. With Arasaka. Mornings, I record at their studio. Then evenings, Yori pops over for a little neighborly cookout. Hmm. And who'd you really sign with? MSM Records. Another pillar of society. Come on. Sit down with me. Tell me where you've been all this time. Steal yourself for a long story. I just really want it to be tragic. As sad as all fuck over all those years. Cause if I hear you spent them with the nomads, open road, winning your hair, or cool and relaxed in orbit, and now you just pop by to shit all over my life, well, I'ma lose my damn mind. Listen, judge for yourself. Oh, fuck. Remember? The one damn time Henry showed up sober and clean as a whistle. Uh-huh. And played absolute tripe. At least Danny was happy. Stuff about you being depressed. It's true. Nope. Promo strategy. Suicide attempts, too. Think putting a bullet through your skull will help your sales? Didn't work for you. Nobody remembers Samurai. Now you're just butthurt because I managed fine without you. Fuck me, got no answer to that. Never did get what Denny saw in that guy. I mean, smart in that one. Maybe too smart for the company she kept. Nah, Denny always went for losers, incapable of dressing themselves. Oh, Hank was perfect. Half a brain and high all the time. She got to rescue him over and over again. Why'd she never try and fix me? Would have had to get in line, that's why. Who's that? Louise, the ex-wife. The what? Huh, <laughs> you're kidding. How long did it last? Eh, hey, too long. But don't worry, it worked out well. For her. Gave her my house in Tokyo, cars, kids. Yeah. Worked out pretty well for you too then. Still in touch with the gang. Just Nance. Changed her name to Bess Isis. Works for N54 News. Could track down Denny and Henry if you want. Maybe get together? You know, jam or something? Bess Isis. Damn, Nance really went for it. So all I hear is part-time stripper with a thing for ancient Egypt. Shame you died. Sure she would have welcomed your input. How is she in general, besides having nothing to do with music? Could ask her yourself. Henry probably killed his own liver. That nah, would have hurt if he was gone. Got mutual friends. Few calls and I should be able to track him down. Denny might still be in the biz. 
actually had talent and the spine. Yeah, released something not too long ago. Moved to North Oak, too. You just so, said you weren't in touch. Been hearing from her. I think she might be avoiding me. You ever leave this house? Nope. You want to bring Samurai back? Nah, no. Could do one gig, play some dive where nobody plays us. I mean, got my reputation to think about. But I won't have to explain what happened. All this. Nah, we'll spare him. Hella boring story. Biochips, Arasaka's evil schemes, magic pills. We'll just say you're my new input. All right, let's do it. Fuck yeah! Okay! Send you Nancy's number in a sec. I'll go after Henry and Denny. Hmm, I'm not there. Figure it out with V. Sure, uh, you two get along? Not lately, no. We don't have much of a choice, though. How am I? Johnny, you okay? No. Ah, so you must be V. Johnny mentioned something like this might happen. I'll be fine. <laughs> that a hint of disapproval, I hear? Just sit tight for a bit. Rest. Don't worry about a thing. The hell is this concert thing? Did you hear that? Get sharper as the pills wear off. So? Wanna see Samurai live? Probably won't get another chance. Okay. Calling Nancy. Fuck yeah. Nice. Uh, Nancy? Uh, I mean, uh, Bess? Bess Isis? No. This is her underpaid, underappreciated assistant. Steven, N54 News. How can I help? Want to talk to Bess? She's not here. You know when she'll be back? She was supposed to be back two days ago. Went to the Totentons to shoot some stuff, story on Maelstrom. Call back next week or just watch the news. Anything happens to her, I'll be the first to cover it. Got a bad feeling, V. Think we better head to the Totentons.